Greetings, my fellow genetic splicers. Rodamon here. Thank you for tuning in to RimWorld Biotech, The First Wendigo. Episode 5, Gene Ripping. Do I have access to the mech helmet? No, I need machining. No machining, no mech helmet. Next research project is solar. And then after it gets solar, I'll let you guys vote. So genes decay rather quickly when they're not banked in gene banks, so you can't put them on shelves or stockpiles and expect them to to survive for, for, for very long. Uh, but you can sell genes to basically everybody. It's like a universal currency, kind of like art. So that's that much is useful. Where is Kish? Oh, yep, going for more blocks. Good. Once I get solar, I can put a few solar panels up. Oh. Great. The the one that was uh due to be dead via via infection just beat the other one to death. Well, Wendy, you know what? I might as well give you the pleasure of killing him yourself as a bloodlust, because there's just no way that they're going to survive. And then you landed from the sky and you're dead in seven hours. Maybe I can save you in time if I can get out there. Yeah, Wendy, go, go for this one first. Because the other one is uh, ripped already. Just Chris, thanks for the gifted sub. And then you can tend to him so that he doesn't bleed out before our dear leader gets to kill him. And then I'm guessing this wolf is starting to eat the corpses too, so I'm gonna have Zilla go haul the corpses as well. So that the beautiful amount of food that I have out here available to me doesn't get ruined. Hey, actually, while you're out here, I'm gonna have to get the caravanning. Jesus, another one? A baseliner who refuses to do dumb and skilled labor. Well, uh, and you have a bad heart. Sounds like it's going to be fun to butcher you. All right, I need to eat something before I have a mental break. Or just do that. That will stop a mental break. Does this count as red meat? What do you guys think? Is a red Edekeen red meat? Alright, Wendy. Uh, can we get to Yakov in time? I don't think so. Hurry. 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 Witness the death at least. Kill him! Nah, at least you saw the death. <laughs> so close. Kish. Where, what are you up to? You're still building the walls? Alright, that's fine. Well, we've got uh, ten corpses. That ain't nothing. I'll, I'll keep keep the the bills fed and the stomachs filled. And then Bog, you are badly malnourished, I guess. Uh, let me butcher another bug. Because I don't... I want a gene rip Bog. Alright. 
Now you can finally go to sleep. But I was moving your bed. I'm going to move it over here so you get disturbed less. There you go. Cool. All right. Looks like geothermal is going to be after solar. You guys really like power. How long for the fog? That's a good question. Uh, we are coming up on... Oh, math. Two days left? Yep, two days left. Or one. Yeah. Uh, no, it's going to be over. Yeah, it's over. It's done. Woo! I'll drink to that. Uh, who needs solar now? Should... I change research. I'm just going to give you 60 seconds for this. Now that wind is not so grossly broken due to the uh, lifting of the fog, if you guys want me to ch consider changing research off of solar, I still think solar is, just personally, I think it's it's pretty uh, helpful to offset the power demands of uh, a grow light. But if you guys want me to swap it up, I will swap it up. And Parduk, it is time for you to work. Let's get some rice. Of course, the weather controller stopped controlling it being fog, but then the game's just like, yeah, but I like fog, so I'm going to make it fog still. Thanks, game. Thanks, Randy. Just Randy things. Okay, not change research. Still get solar. Orange Chaos, you finished all the, uh, all the components? I see that you missed... Because I didn't mark them. A few. So go back there. And then once you're done with that, uh, hit these. And then this... And then this. And let's get the Xenogene machine going so that we can start ripping. So the way this works, powered on, insert, bog, and carry bog to the extractor. Takes a day. And then we will pull random genes out of bog. Uh, reduced pain, strong immunity, robust digestion. That's kind of what I'd like to rip. This isn't part of the breeding project, by the way. This is just totally separate. Again, a reminder that the goal is to breed germline genes, not xenogenes. Which means um, embryos into growth fat tanks, not inserted genes through gene ripping. They're very different, and uh, I just wanted to make that clear. Still has a lot of eyebrows. Very, very worried. Triply worried. I think that's the worried tattoo. So, Zill is just extraordinarily worried. Wendy, you're starving. Soon we'll have the rice to have real meals, because I have plenty of meat, but I'm trying to stretch the meat so that we don't end up, um... We don't end up, uh... Wasting it on simple meals. So I'm, I'm waiting for fine meals. If you're wondering what you know, why I've been doing what I'm doing. And just letting them eat the packet survival meals, because that's what they're there for.
So lots of components that we just mined up. There's 28 of them sitting on the map to be hauled. What is Solwain doing? Still hauling chunks. Don't haul chunks. You're going to do it anyway. And one thing I haven't noticed that Zilla doing is like making chunks. So waking her butt up. Getting out of bed, you lazy teenager. To go haul my chunks. Uh, my batteries are nice and full, so I'm going to risk the grow light. And I'm going to tell the uh, the small mechs to not use the charger, because they're high enough on power. They're almost all full power to not waste it. So Kish is at 40%, and Solwain, you are at 28, 54. So Orange Chaos, once you're done with the current components, I'm going to have you maybe get recharged so that you can be higher up power-wise and ready for combat. And let's expand the rice so we can grow some more. Kids these days napping all the time? I know, napping on the job too. I mean, granted, I don't pay, I pay her only in food, but I am also completely unconcerned with child labor laws. It's the least of my worries. Solar's done. I'm just going to make sure you still want me to go geothermal. So that is up as an option, but I fully expect it to win. And I'll put... Uh, three panels out here to offset the grow light. Mm. Guarding for Bacchus. Bacchus has captured three prisoners from an enemy faction, no place to store them, wants me to watch over them for 18 hours. I will get three raids Back to back to back in 18 hours of three mechs each, roughly. And it gives me a side trainer of Skip Twiggy, who is a very useless baseliner, and Glitter Orb, or Glitter Orb Uh I'm just going to make the decision to say, no, screw yourself. Anima Chief, that's the dumb, dumbest quest I've been offered in a long time. I'm going to actually use the recharger on Orange Chaos so he's back into service sooner. Did you just build? No. Don't build yourself into a corner where you can't use it. Alright. Piggy's about to be out. And we got robust digestion. Sweet. Which is, uh, which allows us to eat raw without risk of, or eat raw without inefficiencies. Uh, next up, we're going to put the other, the Edekin, in. And then take Bog to bed. Is snow clearing for solar panels a thing? Nope. It is not. 3,200 years from now, we'll come up with snowless solar panels. All right, so we're still doing geotherm. Got it. That's not yours. Put that the hell down. Nice try, idiot. Came this close. 42 and 32. Okay, yeah, we're fine on uh, on that front. 
Will you need to vote it for a third time? Stay tuned, maybe. We'll see how I feel. Do I have a forced open door? I don't. So let's keep this door open as a valid path for raiders. This door also happens to be very far away from my power grid by design. And I am currently generating 20,000 watts. So pretty good, I think. Wendy, I think what I'm going to do is have you build the hydroponics in lieu of research for a bit until we have a little bit more hydroponic benches. Because it would definitely benefit me to be growing a lot more food. Especially if I'm going to have a lot of slaves. If I have a, if I have a lot of slaves and a lot of prisoners, nutrient paste dispense is probably the way to go. Uh, you are now... Yeah, let's haul the components. There's so many components. More batteries? More batteries uh, usually ends up just blowing you up worse when you have short circuit events. Storing a lot of power is actually kind of dangerous without Fuse Mod, and I'm a vanilla player, so I don't play with Fuse Mod. I'm mostly vanilla. This series is pretty much entirely vanilla. So with that in mind, um, more batteries equals more explosions. And I have a considerably flammable base. You know, if I had a stone base, that'd be a different matter. But my base is steel, because that was what was available. Parduke, get growing. Why are you recharging it? Yeah, what are you doing? Quit charging. Oh, because I have you told to charge. Yeah, it's my fault. Uh, assigned group two, and then group one, you dormant recharge now. What about switches to protect more batteries? Yeah, I could have backup batteries. Two sets of batteries. Maybe at some point. I'm not... I'm not concerned, and I'm not bothering with that right now. We got strong melee damage off of the, uh... The Edekin. So let's bank it. And take him to the bed. So, if you take a look here... He is jeans regrowing for 25 days. Which means that, uh... I can't put him in without killing him. Uh... But let's kill him. So, Edekin, you go back in. Because, you know, I don't, I don't really want to feed them right now. I can barely feed myself. So, uh, feeding extra mouths is kind of a... a uh -uh, not going to happen. We'll get to a gene program eventually. But we're not, we're not there yet. Oh, yeah, I could strip them. Good point. Let's uh, pop them out. Strip them. Because he had a wool parka. Very good call. Wouldn't want to waste that. And the blue for a button down isn't too shabby either. The raiders who die are the lucky ones? You're absolutely correct. I, I I wouldn't want to end up like Bog. How starving are you? Moderate? Mm, you'll survive long enough for me to gene rip you. Waste not, want not, right? Instead of that, let's have you continue to hydroponic. I 
I want to get a nice abundance of rice before switching to things like hops or psychoid or cotton or uh, fiber corn. Also, looks like Mr. Roboto Mino needs to go mining again. We're burning through the... Oh, never mind. Attack immediately, short-range weapons, and short-range weapons. Okay. Escort. And group one. Go out there. Stay there, actually. Um... Maybe I'll make this in everybody fights. Just as a safety precaution. Except for you, Parduke. You really are worthless in a fight. So, enjoy the time off. Uh, they're ranged, so I'm going to let them come in and then jump them when they're in. And try to lock them up with brawlers so they can't shoot. Just realized none of this is protected. Or rather, home zoned. I don't want it to catch fire or be ignored for some reason. Okay, that looks right. Hi guys, come on in. <laughs> you had Naturamine too. Was that guy raw? Oh, you imposter. Raw. Yeah, it's not gonna happen, buddy. Quit shooting me, French. Yeah, you're French. Is this the last one? Really? Why? Because th that's weird. That they wouldn't be fleeing by now. But yeah, according to the arrows, that's the last one. All right, come on in. What do you have on you? What do I get? Oh, uh, you don't have any good drugs or anything. That's too bad. You're just made of meat. Oh, but I can capture you and take your genes. So I don't mind if I do. So uh, baseliners don't have genes really worth grabbing, but with small exception, you can still sell them. So all I'm able to do is grab his skin color or hair color, which is not something that a genetic engineer would be interested in for Wendigo purposes, but... Uh, Okay, so you are going to be dormant self-charge, and then I have to repair Solwain, who will go to group two for work. And let's see if I can't junior you before you starve. It will be a race. No matter how the race goes, you're going to lose. I can guarantee it, but uh, hopefully... I win somehow. Uh, Soul Wayne, where'd you run off to? Don't run too far. And I think Soul Wayne's the only damaged mech. Yep. Cool. Oh, <gasps> Exoticus Trader. So here's a good example. Um, because I am not likely to use Robust Digestion or Gene Pack Strong anytime soon, even though they're really, really, really good genes to have, I'm not going to have uh, a colonist in the near future. I am going to sell them on the black market. So I clicked my gene bank and hit eject so that those genes can be sold. Uh, I don't think the... Oh, it's out of range. I'm going to move my gene bank so it's more in range for the future. So I get 150 silver a piece 
for those jeans. Which is nice. They also have Gene Pack Blue for blue skin if I wanted to be a sorry. Uh, I don't think that there's much I want to buy off of them. No. Maybe a telescope for uh, a new recreation type. And then 20 gold for a multi-analyzer when I get there. Oh, that gene bank. Let's uh, let's bank it here, so it actually can get powered. Tech prints are too expensive. Yeah. Oh, all right. Just keep just keep coming. These are a bunch of idiots. They're prepare a while. You're gonna freeze. You're gonna freeze. You're gonna freeze. You might survive. So these guys are prepare a while, but they're going to be dreadfully, ridiculously hypothermic by the time they get to me. Which is fine by me. So I'm just going to make sure to carry the expensive stuff in so that it can't be wasted. And maybe the genes of uh, Raul Ribidor, or whatever his name is, is going to be sellable before the Exoticos Trader leaves. There's also the case that I might not want to keep guns near where Zilla is because weapons encourage uh, slaves to rebel. So I can think about maybe putting shelves outside where uh, she can't gain access to them. Right. Oh, uh, we're already under attack. Come on, just die already so I can sell your jeans. Nah, that's not going to happen. Not in time. I technically don't really need to, uh, I don't really need to wake her up because she's sleeping close enough that I can issue worthwhile orders to, to them. So you got naked speed. Okay, now I do have to wake you up because I want to sell that. More silver for me. Don't mind if I do. Let's have you eat. Actually, uh, yeah, eat one of these and then then you'll cook. So here's even more people that I can steal jeans off of. Actually, Wendy, I'd like for you to witness the death because that will make you bloodlust happy. I know you're like starving or whatever, you're malnourished, but uh, there is blood to be to be worshipped here. So let's do that. Medical emergency. You were dying of malnutrition. Okay, I will feed you. I'll feed you bug. Make sure it's bug and not rice. So, serious hypothermia, serious hypothermia. Wasn't there another one? I thought there was four. Am I wrong? Was there only three? Oh no, one's one's over here. And this guy was the parka user, so he's um, not frozen. So after I feed Mr. Pigman, I'm gonna stick Pigman into the extractor. I just didn't think I had time to uh, extract him before he died of mal malnutrition. Oh, you're getting the kills. This is awesome. She is going to be ecstatic for quite some time to come. They really hate their wall, that wall. I don't really know why they hate this wall, but they really, really, really hate that wall. You're right. Just some wall prejudice. And Orange Chaos is fully repaired. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh, alright. Uh, okay. He didn't even make it. Hey, Zilla. Extract Bog to free up the bed. 
because I have another prisoner to capture. And I have a hold a patch. Kish, you should be working. And you probably have... No, you don't have warm gear. I don't need to strip you. I don't really care. Um, no food. This is the wall segment I need most. And then I did want the uh, the miner bot to go mining. So you are wondering... Oh, there we go. It was a zoning issue. Oh, no. Yeah, I have actually so many... Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Go dormant. I forgot about the thousand steel that are sitting there. So I'll have him keep his power. Kish is getting the farm going. Good. Stream's going pretty pretty good. Pretty good indeed. One little hiccup, but uh, not too much. Let's, uh, if you have any questions, because I have a moment of... Peace and quiet, a brief moment of peace and quiet. Uh, feel free to drop the questions into my uh, into my inbox. So it looks like I'm out of limestone. So I'm going to switch over to slate. I'm going to use granite for a future kill box. So I'm reserving the tough blocks for tough jobs. All right. I'm going to allow you to eat finally because you are very hungry. And then we'll cook. We'll cook, Jesse. Get it? See, that that means something very different in this context, doesn't it? There's no comma in there. Mm -mm. You'd think, but nope. No comma in there. So this is the butcher humanoids, and we're going to uh, butcher it until we have maybe 300 meat. But that's not the bottleneck right now. It's the forbidden rice. Is this a cold climate? No, it's just, it's just, it's, it's white because I use spray paint. Sorry. Yes, it's super cold. Zilla, there's meals for you. Also, why were you trying to eat the Packer Survival Meal? Who were you possibly feeding that to? That's not a, that's not an allowed food for anyone. What are the other mechs doing? So Kish, you need to recharge pretty soon. Soul Wayne, free up the recharger, free it up for Kish. Kish, you should regen. And I should set, yep, he's below threshold, so he'll be regening in a second. Parduk, you can go dormant. Actually, don't, because that rice is about to be harvestable. I've turned all of the rice that, that I can into okay oh well I'll practice tending on you I guess I turned all the rice I can into uh, into cannibal fine meals so we should be set for a while How expensive is it for the brain scanner and the media mech gestator so I can start working on tier two mechs? So one of the issues is I don't have the bandwidth for tier two mechs, so I would have to disable my militors. It's not a terrible idea to start to work on that because the people that I'm gene murdering could also go through a brain scan prior to their gene murder. Um, so that is probably a pretty good idea uh, for me to get one of those out. However, it di does dip into my uh, plasteel reserves, and I don't want to dip too hard into the plasteel reserves, because if I do, I don't have the ability to um, to mul make a multi-analyzer, unless I mine some more up. And there's very, very finite amounts of it on the map tile, as far as I know.
This mech corpses will go here. thing. Oh, someone from the Glow World Empire. Uh, so, you're a cannibal. You came to the right place. The problem is, I don't think you have the clothing to ever make it out alive, but I will try to rescue you. I guess? French, it is your turn for us to extract some French jeans. And then to make some French fries. Oh god, another potter? Okay. Um, hmm. So... The storyteller is throwing people at me because I'm really low pop, so it thinks I need help. Which, obviously, I do not. But I will take free clothing and free meat. That, I won't turn down. So you... Just have a torso bruise. Uh, Zilla can patch that up for you. And then you are naked, which is really dumb on this ice sheet, but maybe you'll be able to walk out of the map tile and I'll get credit for your rescue. Maybe. Wow, so much free stuff. Uh, cloth masks. Okay. It's an odd use of double strand, but sure. So I'm going to try to work on the uh, the scanner, the brain scanner. See if we can't um, gain some some standard cores while we also gene murder. So I'm going to update my priority here. Build a brain scanner. I think those are all the components that were left on the ground. So you're able to walk. I advise you not to try to walk out right now in the negative 36 Celsius temperature. Probably won't end well for you. Zilla, please clean. Until I have a clean sweet bot, you're my cleaner. So now I'll work on the, uh, the scanner. My hauler bot is not hauling things that need, like, steel. I could... Yeah, how about I do that? So... I'm gonna rename Avoid Bugs to uh, Standard Bot Zoning. So now Sol Wayne no longer has access to the farm, because that really doesn't require a, a hull bot. I'd rather have Sol Wayne running across the map grabbing steel. That's going to be a lot more useful for me. Yeah, sorry the links are all chopped up. It's just a bug with Twitch. It censors my links otherwise. Oh, you're not going to survive 
Goa's from the infection. And I don't really want to spend the money or the the resources to tend that. I'm trying to think if the cost of the medicine or his genes in court, you know what? It is worth it, sadly. So I will, it's too bad I can't just like shoot at his finger until it gets cut off. I have to like operate on him, you know? Cause I would totally just unload auto pistol rounds on his hand until his finger fell off and been like, problem solved, but I'm not allowed to do that. Yeah, he's worth more to me. The only reason I'm keeping him alive is he's worth more to me as a sum of his parts if he lives. So that's, that's what I'm doing. You could do amputations? You always could, yeah. It doesn't work if you, the infection is in like a torso, but if it's not in the torso, you're good to amputate. So she's burning the midnight oil, uh, but she got to murder a lot of people recently, so she's pretty happy. And if we start a scanner, I have to insert more steel and more uh, components to scan, because that's basically, you're just like, taking their consciousness and putting it in a robot form. Uh, Soul Wayne is hauling to the scanner right now, so I'm just going to go to sleep. And then you, sir. Uh, Zilla, please feed our guest. Our very naked genie guest. Which one of you have I've gene ripped? Neither. So, Piggy. It's your, or, uh, not, you're not a pig. You're a Neanderthal. Your turn. You're not any good at cooking, are you? Nope. So I'm still stuck cooking for myself. Why are you feeding him? Oh, because I have him perishable cannibal. No food. Maybe he will require food to keep him alive, but not yet. Oh, Soul Wayne, you're grabbing four steel at a time? You're driving me mad, man. Fill the thing up. Eight out of ten. Can we get Wendy an actual bedroom? Uh, if I care to. I, I won't be doing that, though, because I don't care. French! Time to stick you in. You gotta, you gotta figure, if I wanted it, I would have done it by now, right? But it's a... You know, it's a doll bedroom. It's fine. So the other oper operations is gonna be like, rip scan, rip core rip, I think, or something like that. That's probably quote-unquote meta. So when we uh, when we deal with the the prisoners, I'll make sure to try to get a, a core out of them too. So what ends up happening is when you scan the brain, you get scanning sickness for I think it's like two days. I don't know why it doesn't have a timer. That's probably something that will be patched. And then you can rescan them again. It's a pretty short cooldown. But you do have to spend steel and uh, components to put them through the scanner. So it's not free. You. And then you get a standard subcore, and the standard subcore can be turned into certain standard tech mechs, like uh, pikemen, scorchers, scythers, and tunnelers use standard subcores. The clean sweeper still uses the basic subcore, but it's just unlocked on standard tech. Yeah, you gotta build core from something, yeah. I, it's absolutely fair of a game mechanic. I'm not complaining at all. Just to make that clear, I think it's balanced that way. You're at 15%, you should still charge. Are you still charging? Oh yeah, you're still charging. You're at 97, so you're full. And then Parduke, you need to charge soon as well. I'm gonna make you go dormant, because there's 
not much else for you to do at the moment. I broke these walls down so that this is all one contiguous limestone zone just for aesthetics. And then we can go back to um, to slate. In fact, I'll build the whole thing in slate and start uh, stone walling up. Get rid of the steel walls that are flammable that uh, raiders like to set on fire and walk away from. Sheila, thank you for the sub. Very strange name you got there. So once Goas is done extreme starvation, I might have to feed him. Oh god, uh, I'm going to have to feed him, like, immediately, as soon as he's out. Because you died at 100. He's at 95. What are you at? 50 and 61. Uh, some bugs might need to be butchered. So... I'll go butcher up another bug to feed my prisoners. Keep them alive just long enough to use all their parts. That was a really small bug. Try again. Wow! Got strong immunity and strong melee damage. That's uh, that's pretty good. Not something I would want to put into a... Um... Uh, Zilla, you're losing your bed for now. Not something I would want to put into a slave, because I don't want to give a slave strong melee damage. That seems like a bad idea. So, the food... I'm going to remove rice from this queue, so we don't feed rice anymore. It's just going to be... Um... Raw bug meat. So you, sir, are going to be in raw bug meat to keep you alive. And then Von Doom, you need your genes extracted. And I'm only doing this to keep him alive long enough for me to uh, scan him and screw with him some more. Alright, I need more steel for the scanner to be turned on. And then Orange Chaos, I'm going to actually power you on. And have you go exactly, mine that area. So, uh, asking if I want a mech cluster land on me. It's a Lancer Scorcher, Countdown Activator, Proximity Activator, Mech Node, 4 turrets. And that would give me 4 Honor or an Eltex Vest or a Power Claw. Do I accept a mech cluster? Yes or no? Hey, Jordan. Thank you for the resub. You're super excited to see biotech? You'll have to catch us on YouTube? Uh, yeah. Absolutely. Alright, so French, I'm going to be giving you raw bug too. We do need the honor, but only if only if you guys think it's like worth the effort. The honor isn't our primary goal. Hey, it's the red meat. So French, let's get you scanned. Oh, you have scanning sickness. Uh, I have to wait until Doom is out. Or Goas. Let me scan Goas. And my, where is my, my farm bot? You have like work to do to get work. <laughs> There's pants in the way. Okay, scans are done. Genes are harvested. I need to feed you again. 
Wish it wasn't so. And then, of course, Zilla needs a place to sleep. So, let's switch these beds around. I should just make it wider, but I'm lazy, so whatever. God, stop giving me free people! Even if they are a waster. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Randy, I see that you're trying to be generous in your... I'm gonna be really annoying until you listen to me. You better make room in your colony, ha ha ha, kind of way. How soon are you dead? 20 hours? And you have a parka on? Yeah, you'll be fine. We're not going to do the cluster. And now there's room for everyone. You f oh, I should patch you. Good enough. Just as long as you ain't bleeding. I'm trying to get the rep for saving Mama Set, but, uh. Oh, that's right where the vent is. Well, who needs a vent? We're gonna expand the zoning so that my constructo bot can get out here. And let's flip flop these. So what I'm trying to do is have it be not flammable on the outside and then something that can open close quickly on the inside for security. Orange Chaos, you are done. I can see a hollow spot there. Clear as day. What's your power at? 62? Yeah, you're fine. Keep working. Uh, I wish I could tell you to wear clothing. I just can't, and you're not going to make it. You're just going to topple right the heck over and force me to save you again. Uh, there is a way to do this. It's a weird way, but I could rescue him to a bed that's heated on the edge of the map. It's just, like, way more effort than it's worth. So, I guess we're eating him. Which is ironic, considering his cooking skill. But he is gourmand, so, you know. Giving one up for the team. I have two uh, standard sub cores. Wondering if I should get a third. Okay, Von Doom, you give up your your uh, skin color. Thank you for watching RimWorld Biotech, the first Wendigo, which originally streamed live on Twitch October 27th. If you have any feedback or questions for me, let me know in the comments below. If you'd like to catch a live stream of mine, Rodamont.com has my stream schedule and countdown timers to upcoming streams. If you'd like to join my gaming community, Rodamont.com also has a link to Discord, as does the description of this video. Thank you so very much for watching, and a special thank you to my Patreon patrons, Twitch subscribers, and viewers like you that made it all the way to the credits and support the channel. I'll catch you next episode or an upcoming stream. Farewell, my fellow mad scientists, 